I um, just mustn't forget my secret number. Okay, how, what happens now? Okay, what do you want to do? Draw money? Yes. Okay, should we draw? Okay. Okay, you got savings account. First savings account? Yep. Okay, the amount? Ten rand. That's all I've got. <laughs> now, wait, wait, I've only got ten rand in my account, so won't you close the transaction? No, it won't. You can have a no balance in your account. Excellent, but what about charges? Don't you, you don't charge? Get charge service fee. This is fantastic. I think I like this method of banking, but now why is it taking such a long okay, time? I'm going through to the bank to, to match your secret card and to check your balance. Please give it to me. Yes! This is just like magic. Who needs a magician? Please move your card. Okay, and your transaction slip will be coming out now. What's a transaction slip? Okay, it gives you your banking details, your balance, oh, your so I must keep this as well. Please. Well, thank you very much. It is as easy as one, two, three. What do you say we go for more chances? I'd love that. <laughs> I am now the proud owner of my own auto club card. I can't believe how easy it was. And you know what the best thing about the Standard Bank is? You know your money is always safe. So, for KGB Roundabout, I'm Kim Freckleton. Thanks, Kimmy. Yeah, it is very easy. Well, you don't need good looks to do your banking with the best, but That's you... your favorite KGB program. Ah, oh, let's see. I like that Jetsons. The Jetsons, yeah, I also like that. Now tell me, do you know what you want for yourself? Uh, Mickey Mouse backpack? Yes, well, enjoy it. And how about sharing those prizes with Woo! us, guys? Woo! Now, I hate to rush, but I have to get ready for Mousetrap, so let me quickly tell you that if you want to be a freebie winner next Saturday, then you must call this line. And that magic goes me mod. And he is Willem Kutsia, five from Ska. Before we go, we must fill up our KTV logo with our rascals. And I must remember to save one or two for me to eat. And if you want to enter the Count the Candy competition, then check out your September Mnet guide. And now it's time to see what's up <laughs> It's Saturday morning, and you know what that means. Four hours of non-stop, uninterrupted pleasure with your favorite channel of friends. Hello, Dr. Double two, three, four, five. And here is our first letter. It comes from Barry Bartlett, and he's from Middleburg. He says that his favorite program is The Little Flying Bears. Well, they are really cute, and thanks for writing, Barry. Thanks a lot for the letter, and please do write again. Well, now that we're up to date with you guys, let's get along with the Get Along Gang. And from Brain Teasers and Art, it's time for McGee and Me, and it's also time for me to get ready for Roundabout, which is coming up real soon. And on the liquor also leg, we have none other than the Licorice Man! Yeah! <laughs> and our contestants have to beat the clock, but they must also beat the trap when the sound is heard! That means that the trap has been fired, the boot kicks the bucket, and that silver ball rolls down the chute for the last time! All right. At this point, one of the contestants has to run right around the outside of the game to tag their partner, who then dashes inside to the safety steam valve to switch it off before the ball reaches this point. Otherwise, the green ball falls in the red bathtub, onto the seesaw, the green man falls in the yellow tub, and down, oh dear, comes that trap. And our contestants win some great prizes on each leg. They sure do to let you have great prizes, our contestants can go home with. Yo! Shake it, here we go. Lucky number time. That's right, Kelly. And the first audience number is 26. Number 26. Come on out here. And it's number 56. Come on out here. All right, we've got 56 over here. Let's draw another. Let's draw another. Here we go. And it's number three. Number three. Come on out. Number three. You're going to play for Mousetrap, the board game. Have we got a number three? There we go. Both from Reggie's. All right. What's your name? Eva. And go. All right, let's meet our contestants for this week. Kim and Kelly, bring them out. All right, are you coming? Mike. And this is my good friend, Kerry. Mike and Kerry, all right. All right, Mike. What What? are your interests? Tennis, soccer. All right, Michael. Michael and Kerry, what do we do? We bounce our way through the balloon tunnel. You come out the other side. You wait for each other because then we pick up the tennis balls and knock the four balloons out of the cups. Then we've got general knowledge questions. If you don't know the answer, what do you say? Pass. Pass. Then we get three correct and we move on. Is the clock ready? Yeah!
All right, let's begin that famous count. Three, two, one, go! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Balloons everywhere, don't worry about the camera, no questions. They got track, off you go, off you go! Go, Mike, go! All right, Kerry, call for him, here we go! All right, now that's your fastest way through. Word in the title, Star Trek. Trek, huh? Yeah, 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 I don't think this, this doesn't look good. This does not look good. Oh, come on, come on, come on. That looks good. That looks good. That looks pretty good. All right, two on. Try that over here. Try that over here. Yes, 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 yes. yes. And put the last one on. There we go. It's on there. You can feel the rope hoops. Oh, right, into the rope hoops. All right, then. Six minutes, 33. Plenty of time, but make it fast. Alphabet, alphabet, son. All right. Got you. Right there, my other darling. Right, right. That's it. One, two, three. You've got three. And two in here. Two in here. Two in here. No, two in here. This one. That's me, you. That, what you doing? Get out of the way. Just, just, hey, come on. There, that's me. Don't you do that. I'll get you. There's one more. That's it. They've done it. That's me in there. Stop the clock. Stop time. <laughs> They're playing for that four star prize from Sony, that fabulous digital radio. And what have we got on Simba? We've got Kim's favourite, the slippery slidey pole. Get to the other side of that, touching the floor. Otherwise, I'll send you back. Then we've got general knowledge questions. I want three correct answers. If you don't know the answer, you just say pass. Then we're onto the green base, the golf course, onto the links. And I want six balls through the other side. I don't care who knocks them through. Then we've got the artist's table. All Who's right, the puzzle table. Ball. Who's going to do the drawing? It's going to oh. be the lady this time for the last show. <laughs> All right. Are you ready? Steady, go! Let's go, Kerry! Go on, Kerry, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. You got the gymnast behind you there. All right, here we go. Is a person, is a person who fought in a war called a veteran or a veterinarian? A veteran, you got one right. What number? Come, let us try. Off you go, off you go, right? Okay, now then, with 500 plus what mystery number makes a thousand? No, it's 300. Which is shorter, a skirt or a mini skirt? A mini skirt. Yes. All right, you got two right. One more, Does one peanut more. butter come from a plant or an animal? Plant. A plant. You got yes. two right. All right, let's go. Six balls, balls through the other side. Put them on the line and hit them right through them there. Guys, come on. We want six balls so you can do it. Okay, come on. We're playing for that three star. Yes. yes. Four, five. One more. One more. One more. One more. One more. Yes, come on, here we go. All right, come on, Kerry, come to the other side. All right, draw these for me. Here we go. Screwdriver, yes. All right, draw. What's this last one? 27 seconds. Now, come on. Something that you... 22 seconds, come on. She's a good artist. 22 seconds. Something that you... Desperate. No, something you read. A book. A book. A book, he's got it. All right, stop the clock. Stop the clock. Come here, Kerry and Michael. Here we oh, go, Mike. Right. All right, you stand over there. I've got some questions. I've got some questions. I want three correct answers yet again, but this time I'm going to fire the trap. And you've got all the time that it takes for the trap to hit the floor. All right, then. Are you ready? Fire the trap. Which doesn't begin with a K? Kite, kid, kick, or cup? Yes. Cup, you got one right. What liquid do most plants need to live and grow? Water. Water. Yes. You got two right. What's a shorter way to put this problem? Two plus two plus two plus two equals eight. No. Oh. Yes, it is. Four plus four. Yeah. You're right. You're right. All right. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop the that wasn't the answer that I had. The but you're quite right, Kerry. You are quite right. That's a perfectly good answer. That's a perfectly good answer. And they have won that My First yes. Sony Radio three-star prize. Yeah. Oh, I'm Sony. Yeah. Trade my hand. Very well done. Excellent. Excellent. So, from my trap mechanics, Kim and Kelly. We've had great fun the last 26 weeks every Thursday at 4.30. And, of course, Saturdays at 10. So. Until we meet again, well, thank you for being on your favourite game show, Miles <laughs> All right, all let's right. get that over there. All right, one of us next. Let's get in. All right, come on.
Step was produced for MNET by the Framework Television. That's the songs I've ever seen, but it's really sad. And now it's time to move on to our next program. So let's go and see what's happening in Flying House. Whether they into the ocean or whatever the case may be. Yes, and also when they enter the atmosphere, the friction causes them to burn up or something really confusing. Well, from interesting facts, it's over to our friendly ghost, Casper and his friends. All the programs, and he loves all the presenters. Hey, thanks for that, and why don't you write again? <laughs> yes, I agree, and I've also got a letter from Carla Nell of Creel. She says her favourite program was Darkwing Duck. Well, I have to agree with you, he was ultra, ultra cool. Thanks for writing, and please write again. Three times as high as Mount Everest. Well, from interesting facts, it's over to a great program, and that leaves Casper and his friends. Well, guys, thanks for spending the whole day with us, and make sure you don't miss us tomorrow, where you can see great shows like Tailspin, Casper and Friends, James Bond Jr., and the Sun Kiss Kids. Bye. Cheers! Bye, guys! Bye. See ya. running a marathon or anything like that. Just go out, get out into the sun and play some tennis or cricket or soccer or even throw a frisbee. Yes, I agree. Light exercise for everyone. So get out there and get some sun on your face. But now it's time for our first program. Tail split. <laughs> <laughs> says he can't. He decides he can. It's one thing to start a business, but to build cars is another. And that's what Tucker is all about, a man doing something no one thought possible. Action and hope as one man chases his dreams. From the creator of store, Star Wars, <laughs> we George give Lucas. it, yep, we give it 7 out of 10. <laughs> Yo, kids! Welcome from us here on the West Hot Mountain. If you don't know what I'm talking about, check it out a little bit. And now, guys, get ready for thrills and spills, fun and adventure right here on KTV. No, no, no. Yes. No, no, no. It looks very funny. We start the mega funky new KTV with the Get Along Gang. Yes, so now we're going to have fun with our visitors. Now, what we're going to do is... No, wait, I'm not going to tell you. I'm just going to choose somebody. Who will it be? Will it be you? Will it be you? So, me, 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 me. I'm going to choose you. Come on down. Come on, jump down. There we go. Now, what we're going to do here is we're going to blindfold you. Okay. What is your name? Kerry. Kerry, okay. Where are you from, Kerry? 
Johannesburg. Johannesburg. All right, what standard are you in? Standard five. All right, now what you have to do is this delicious stuff here. This is not breakfast, by the way. It's gooey, yucky stuff. And you have to take five things out and tell me what they are. On your marks, get set, go. Go! showing Edgar's latest summer wear, so don't move an inch. All those stuff under the clouds. And now it's time for Raw Tunage, and remember for the fashion show afterwards. <laughs> Thank you, Hello, and hi to all you fashion freaks. Welcome to Kids Clubber. I am Kim Fregelton, and this is Neville Kova, and we're going to show you the hippest way how to dress. Now, Neville, you were a naughty boy, and I saw you go and have a little peek. What do you think of the clothing? Well, Kim, I actually think the clothing is fantastic. Well, I'm not going to take his word for it. I want to see for myself. So take it away, model. Bad, bad boy. Uh -huh. are not cool. They are ultra, ultra hot. What do you think, Neville? Well, Kim, I actually really like that spotted, that spotted shirt that Kim is wearing. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's cool. You know, it's nice to see the, all the bright colors in summer this range. It's nice. It's no, lot, not a lot of black. It's bright colors. And what I have to get is a pair of those mirrored John Lennon sunglasses. They are so funky. And you know what I also noticed? A lot of the girls are wearing their caps backwards and the guys. It's a much more trendy way and sunglasses are very in. And the main thing to remember is that we all have to be tanned because it's all short. But we'll be seeing some more fashions later. But the fashions you've just seen, you can get them from Edgar's clothing from as little as 40 Rand and they go up to 120 Rand. Yeah. Marty's Khan and a whole lot of other characters, then get yourself down to Marina Glen in East London. The action starts after KTV time, of course, at 11.30 and will go on until about 1 o'clock. Kimmy, I know I've told you this a million times, but a little while ago, I had the thrill of my life. I found a sport that is so exciting that one can really get their nerves into it. It's Formula M motor racing. You know, since Wayne actually went to the Formula M track, he has not stopped talking about it. So let's go see what it's all about. Yeah. 
Well, what I call was the most thrilling explanation of many days competition and camaraderie in the Rudaport Ice Deadfoot. It's a cultural event that features choirs from South Africa and as far afield as Bulgaria and Austria. If you'd like to get involved in the action, get on down to Florida Lake today. It's the last day at 2 and go down to the main tent. Later on this evening at about 7 there will be an evening concert with all the nationalities of the world strutting their stuff plus a prize giving event. some more hot news for you. From next week, you can own your very own Walt Disney classic, namely Beauty and the Beast. Take a look at this. Well, I can actually think of nothing better. Imagine having your very own Beauty and the Beast that you can sit home when you want with your friends and watch it. Well, you see, the best thing about this is you can watch it as many times as you like. I oh, know I personally like to watch these, these videos a million times and now you can watch it a zillion times because you can get it from <laughs> any retail store nationwide from next week. You see, they're going to be selling for about 79 Rand 99. If you don't want to pay that, then you can call in the number we're going to give out in just a few moments because we have not one, not two, not three, but four videos to give away. Right, I think that we should take a look at the phone number that these guys should call if they want to give away and if they want to win all these fantastic giveaways. Excellent idea. Right, and this is the address you can write to because we've got some great freebies for you right here on KTV Roundabout. It is KTV, PR Box 6444, Westgate. The giveaways! We have 30 family tickets to give away for today's air show. And... As you all know, we have got four copies of Beauty and the Beast to give away, and uh, they're going to be given away to one person from each region. That's one from Transvaal, one from Durban, etc., etc., etc. The air show tickets are only. And now I'd like to get your event when you on to KTV Roundabout, and all you have to do is send all the info to this address. KTV Roundabout, PO Box six triple four, Westgate seventeen thirty four. Or you can call us on the roundabout hotline on Johannesburg dialing code 011 47 4. Weekdays and mornings only. More news, views and interviews just for you. <laughs> and you'd better not miss the Jetsons which are up right now. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning to you. Bye. It's time to hit the freebies box and we are giving away Johnson & Johnson bath time buddies and we are talking major bubbles over here. So come on, let's dig! Dig, okay. dig, 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 and the winners are, no, <laughs> they are Matthew Rome of Pretoria. Well done. Yeah. We then have Byron Miller of Ramburg. Yeah. Is Jonathan Rickett of Newcastle. Yay! And Tion Barn from Florida. I hope you enjoy your bubbles. And lastly, Brandon Knox of Woodstock. Yay! Yay! Well done to all of you. Now, if you didn't win, do not despair because you can always win next week. But hey, guys, if your entry is not in here, then you don't win. So get your postcard to this address. It is KTV Freebies, PO Box 6, Triple 4, Westgate, 1734. Party on, Clint. Party on, Kim. <laughs> <laughs> now, Kim, what do you say we change play just a little bit, just a tiny bit? You mean make it more hip, more funky? Yeah, hey, that's it. You know what I'm talking about. I like it, but look, guys, we have to see if they like it. What do you All think? All right. Like all it. right, Kim, that says it all. All right, this is how it works. We're going to take two or three callers and, you know, from our toll free line, all right, and then they're going to get to choose one of their favorite tracks from our Power Pack Edition menu. Check it out. that got through. Hi, who am I speaking to? From Pauline. Pauline, and where are you calling from? Utenhaag. And how's the weather in Utenhaag? It's beautiful. Oh, you're so lucky. The weather here is terrible, but you know that. You've been seeing outside. Now, have you had a look at the menu? Yes. 
Okay, now what song would you like? Talent, one more chance. You got it, good choice. Now remember to keep watching, do not touch that remote because your choice could be afterwards. Loading Highland one more time. All right, guys, we haven't changed, we haven't changed totally because we still got CD giveaways. And today we're giving away Rage CDs. And our first lucky winner for today is Damien Brighton from Santon. Congratulations, Damien. Okay. Do not panic. We still give away two CDs. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give my Rage CD to the next caller. So, hello, good morning. Who am I speaking to? Alan. Hi, Alison, where are you calling from? The Mother City, Cape Town. Oh, and how is the weather in Cape Town? Oh, it's cloudy. Is it so no going to the beach today? No. I'm oh, sorry. Now, bummer. Tommy, you have won a Rage CD. Do you like the CD Rage? Yes. I love that song. Run to you. And what do you think of our new show? Oh, it's cool. It's totally cool. wild. It's so, so cool. Now, would you like to take a look at the menu again? Um, yes, yes. Okay, okay, let's take a look at it. what I would choose. So the question is, what do you want? Um, I'll take Aladdin. You'll take? Aladdin. No, I don't have oh. it. It's Peebo Bryson. It's not Aladdin. But let's take it. Peebo Bryson and Regina Bell. No, Peebo Bryson. Much nicer. I think it's much nicer. That's what I said. It's much nicer. Oh, I give up, Kim. <laughs> All right. We'll be back with more playback choices right after the little flying bears. But first, let's hear what Heather's got to say. Heather. Freebie time and what number? Have when one man decides to build cars when everyone around him says he can't, he decides he can. It's one thing to start a business, but to build cars is another. And that's what Tucker is all about, a man doing something no one thought possible. What's this? Did you put this in my car? It's talk back time, and I've got a letter from Adila Musa. She's nine years old, and she says she has got lots of KTV stationery, and she loves watching the programs. Her favorites are Scooby-Doo and James Bond Jr. Thanks for the letter. Hello, she I'd letter to their friends like we all do. Well, today they're all very interested in someone called Citizen Max. I wonder what that's all about. Anyway... With all the news that kids can use, this is Sunday Morning Roundabout. In the studio is Kim Frickleton and Wayne Cupping. Good morning, Wayne. Good morning, Kimmy. And of course, a very big yellow to all of you out there. I vote that we get started and getting right into our first bit of news for this morning. Sorry, Wayne, I veto that. I say we first take a look at the headlines. This morning on Roundabout, we remind you about Standard Bank's own teen magazine, we take another look at Mr. and Miss Johannesburg youth winners, and we take a look at what to do this week. Great, now can we start? Most excellent. If you have a little bit of money that you want to put away safe and sound, then the natural thing to do is go out and open a Standard Bank Order Club account. When you do, there is an added bonus. That's right, your very own copy of Rave magazine will be mailed to you. It is packed with loads of interesting articles from fashion to music and everything in between. The important thing to remember is that the mag will be mailed to you, so you'd better keep on checking your post box. Last week on Roundabout, we featured an item about the recent Mr. and Miss Johannesburg Youth Competition. And now, due to popular demand, we have it for you once again. You know, personally, I think it's just because you're in it, Wayne. But anyway, let's take another look at the Mr. and Miss Johannesburg Youth. Caesars Palace in Bronfenty, Johannesburg is the venue for the 1993 Mr. and Miss Johannesburg Youth Competition. Well done there, Tamron and Ross, and of course you, Wayne. <laughs> Next week, Benmore Garden Shopping Centre in Johannesburg are planning a lot of fun just for you. For starters, tomorrow Jacques Marais will be performing Feast of Magic, Juggling and Laughter at Teddy Bear Picnic from about 2 p.m. Yep, but that's not all, Kimmy. On Tuesday, you'll be able to meet Nick and his famous animals that can do almost anything. That's at about 1 o'clock. And then on Saturday the 9th, there's going to be a big small race. Uh, what? A big what? <laughs> That's right. There's going to be a big race of small or rather remote oh, control cars. The race is happening at about 10 in the morning. That's fun at Benmore Garden Shopping Centre this week. Tomorrow there is Jacques Marais and the Teddy Bears Picnic from 2pm. 
Nick and his talented pets on on Tuesday from 1 o'clock and remote control car racing on Saturday from about 10. Well, and that is it for KTV Roundabout this Sunday morning. It sure is, and I hope that everybody realizes how easy it is to promote an event on Roundabout. All you have to do is send the info and visual material to this address. And the address is Roundabout Peel.